to check the status of the uh, the fax threads and the database threads, uh, go to the administrative utilities and go to faxstat.exe. Double click and launch it, enter in your right fax uh, server name, and then you'll click on miscellaneous and protocol selection. And you'll change it to RPC over TCP IP. At that point, uh, you can click on the first button, which is a server status, uh, the database status for the server, and it'll show you each of the threads. If you cycle through the threads with a down arrow, uh, what you'll see each one has some activities and then you'll find the first one that's not activated. That's as many threads as the server has spawned. Uh, in our case here, we've had, we've had five threads on the database that have been used. Uh, sixth one has never been used. And then file thread one's used, two, three, four, five, six, seven, all the way up until you find one. Uh, all nine threads in our server has been used. So um, that's how you can tell uh, what, uh, which threads are used and, and which ones are not. If you want to change it, then you can go to uh, Enterprise Fax Manager, click on the uh, login to EFM, go to the server module, go to the advanced tab, and these two fields here, your maximum threads and your maximum file I.O. threads, that's where you can adjust those. Um, each one takes up a little more, middle, little more memory, so uh, you don't need to put them too high, um, but that will help the server run a little more efficiently. Thanks.